Hey everyone, and Pisces, welcome to your June reading. Let's find out what's coming up for Pisces in love, in life, and everything in between for the coming month. Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter. I hope everyone is having fun, doing well, and um, enjoying the long weekend ahead. Pisces. One more. Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter. All right. We are thinking, Pisces. Okay. I see that you could be healing from a heartache. Um, reminiscing about the past, reminiscing about a situation that may have given you disappointments. Not necessarily all about love. So apply it to, to whatever you are currently more focused on in life, in which, whichever area in your life that you are more focused on. Pisces, I see that um, you could be thinking the beginning of the month, you will be um, ruminating about, um, or not really ruminating, but more of just thinking through, reminiscing about the experience, the incident that may have disappointed you. It could be in your love life. It could also be at work or within your community or even within your family dynamics, right? Um, at the bottom of the card, underlying energy is the devil. So we're coming into the month, Pisces, feeling like our hands are tied. Yeah, there, there must be something that you really want to pursue, you really want to have, but it seems like the universe is not giving you that, at least in the beginning of the month. And that's where you start to, well, perhaps relax a bit. You will be leaning backwards a little bit and start to think, is there any other possible ways that you could address that situation? Is there any other um, means that you can have a, that you can turn things around? Yeah, that can make, um, that can turn things around. So if, if it is a heartache, this could be you thinking about, is there a possibility to connect with this person once again and, and have a good talk, have a good uh, type of conversation? Or if it is about your career and um, you did not get what you want, for example, or if you were proposing something that were, was not um, taken, um, taken in or you did not get any more buy-in, this is you now thinking, how do you turn things around? What would be the other possibilities that you could do in order to um, make life happy again? Yeah, Because your goal here, and that is something that I really like in your spread today, because even if you're coming in with feeling like you can't do anything much, you're tied, you're stuck, you're feeling as though... Perhaps this would be the remnants of the current, current month's energy. You're feeling as though um, you're overworked, for example, or you're just toiling, or you're just putting your head down in, into something, into thinking about a relationship that's not progressing, right? You're coming into the new month, like taking a step back, leaning backwards and, and thinking, is there a possibility to address this is there a possible is there any other means to find a win-win solution because your main goal is positivity your main goal is to have a fruitful outcome to make things better to make things um at least for you in your life to make your life better to enhance your current state of living for example All right, so that will be in the beginning of the month. And then moving on, I feel like there is a reason for your Pisces to be happy. You know why? Um, you will get to a point 
sometime in the middle of the month where two choices or at least two, two choices will be presented to you. So you start off with a month not knowing what to do. Hands are tied. It is as if you're stuck. But towards the middle of the month, you will get to have two concrete options at hand. Yeah. And not just that, you will have to decide what's best for you amongst those two options. Yeah. And whatever decision you will make, Pisces, um, think things through. Yeah, you have to think things through because that decision that you will make will propel you to what we call the Ten of Pentacles. And that is the center of your reading. So June would actually bring about some form of abundance, um, happiness, reason to smile, Pisces, reason to be happy. It's because if you were feeling stuck in the past, this time, now you get to choose the right thing for you to move forward into. If you have been waiting for a decision, um, an offer, a call, uh, whatever you've been waiting for, yeah, that you feel once you get it, it will make you happier. I feel like that's going to come in the middle of the month. All right. And once you make that decision, that decision will actually create some changes in your life. So you will have to make some changes for some of you. This could be a decision to move, to move to a new place, to relocate or to move to um, a new job, yeah? a new offer that is uh, presented to you. But whatever that is, whatever decision you make, Pisces, it will bring you to a more stable state. It will bring you to a state where, or to a state of being, right, where you feel like you are stable, you're secure, and this time this is truly meant for you and you're getting it. So for some, this could be the job that you have been longing to have, for others, this could be the passion that you are waiting to pursue or waiting to have a some form of fruition. Yeah. If you are a painter, this could be a gallery that you have been preparing for so long. You've been looking for uh, the right space, the right time to do it, and sponsors and things like that, right? So, And finally, you get it. You get it because you will make a decision the choice or the option will be presented to you and then you make a decision, finally you'll get it. And whatever choice you make, it will bring you abundance, um, it will bring you some, uh, some sense of stability and it will make you feel like things are starting to move once again in life. So the, you're, you will be feeling stuck even today, perhaps towards the beginning of the month, but that is just the beginning of it all. Things will turn around, yeah. Things will there will be some movements, and things will quickly change in your life, yeah. Things will quickly change in your life. For some of you, I feel like this could be um, an endeavor, uh, an offer, um, or an idea that you have been pursuing for the last six months, for example, or last five months. You've been trying to um, conceptualize things, right? In order for things to be manifested, you try to create an idea, present it. If you're in, for example, whatever industry you're in, in sales, you were trying to pursue something. If you're a developer, you're trying to develop an application for the past five months, yeah? And now, that, that sort of feeling, Pisces, those are just example, but it will come to some form of final stages, yeah, where you get an offer, you get that form of clarity where, yes, this is where you should be heading. And things will, will really change quickly. Yeah? It will speed up the process. And you will see, Pisces, that from here, this would be a chance for you then to see yourself evolving, um, expanding. You will have more opportunities to expand your network, to um, perhaps even increase your income streams, for example. Yeah. 
And I feel like once you, you get to make this decision, once the change has occurred, Pisces, then you are ready. You will be ready to head on to a new path. And whatever you have been, let's say, working on or you have been stuck in something for years and years or months in the past, that will already be in the past. You're done with it. Yeah. Basically, you will be wrapping up whatever you have right now um, that's probably fading out or possibly where you're already done with it. Yeah, your current situation, that means you're done and over it. You're just wrapping it out, closing it, closing the chapter in your life, and then moving on to this new chapter that is meant for you. Yeah, so that is what I see, Pisces. This is a very good reading. This is your monthly reading, so I'm just doing the fixed spread for you. If you want to check out um, love readings or messages for the day, um, watch out for my... Uh, readings uh, during the next few days advice Pisces let's see soulmate new romance is on its way watch out for signs that are leading you to your true love so yeah so now if you're if you're probably hurt in, in a situation right now Pisces and you're trying to see how you can get out of it I feel like the next month is a chance for you to be able to wrap it up because there is something, something new that is coming, an opportunity. And in, in this case, yeah, it's a romance that is on the way, but something new, which will give you some form of stability. So it could be soulmate, could be somebody that definitely could change your life, Pisces. And at the same time, somebody who would stay for a while. It's not a one night kind of thing. Somebody who would stay with you for a while to experience life together. Oops, wait. Time is up. No second chances. No revisiting. There's something better waiting. Oh my goodness. So whatever this is, it could be about your current job, your current love affair. This is saying that time is up. That is ready to be wrapped up. Because something new, there's something better that is waiting. And perhaps for some of you, it could be a new soulmate, new romance yeah, coming into your life. For some, if it is not about romance that you're focusing on right now, if it is about money matters, financial career, job, this is saying that where you're currently at right now, if you're feeling stuck and unhappy and you were trying your way, your best to find um alternative means yeah for you to pursue this is the time yeah so it's time to wrap up whatever you've been used to because you have graduated from it it's time to move on to the next chapter i'm gonna leave it at that and let me know if this resonates in the comment section below and don't forget to hit like and subscribe